Hi, my name is Rand Parton and I'm the creative director of Apollos. This is my brother Shay Parton and we were born in Santa Barbara, California and we uh, grew up surfing in Santa Barbara and we moved down to Los Angeles about 10 years ago to start our brand Apollos. We grew up in Santa Barbara, California and our parents knew that we'd be Southern California monsters and we'd get to see the rest of the world. So from an early age, we traveled everywhere with that proverb that everyone knows, teach someone how to fish rather than give them fish. But what we learned across these travels is that there's plenty of well-trained fishermen they often don't have the right bait or a large enough pond. So we saw this opportunity to co-design products with communities and cooperatives to bring them to a wider audience and a stronger market and really anchor it into this word of policy, which translates to global citizen because we believe all people are created equal and should have equal access to the global market. Uh, we were introduced to the Freaks team through our dear friend now who lives in Torrance, California and now introduced us to Ken who owns the retail store in Japan and they um, approached us with this incredible idea to work with some of the people that have been displaced and affected by the tsunami um, around the I think for us, what really drew us to the partnership with Freaks was that when you walk into their shops, um, it's a lot like walking into someone's home. And that personality um, and that warmth, I think, is very characteristic of how Shay and I like people to experience our store. So that like-mindedness really was a deep connection that led us to developing this partnership to create employment in Japan. Uh, from tsunami victims. For Shay and I, we've been really um, inspired by some of the traditional textile uh, techniques that have been really perfected in a country like Japan, um, one of which is done and practiced globally, but I think really perfected in Japan is the art of indigo dyeing. So indigo was a really large part of the collaboration, um, just the deep color and the fact that it wears in over time and, and looks almost better and it kind of travels with you and that characteristic of the garment take on a new life of their own. I think um, as part of this garment telling a new story, even though they're representing this incredible impact story in Japan that we were really passionate about. You know, when I first met Ken, he had told me that when the tsunami had hit, he ended up um, driving his Westphalia van to the Fukushima plant area and camped there and just uh, volunteered for over a month. Um, and I think that commitment to helping people is really indicative of their culture and the idea, philosophy behind the store. So for us, I think as long as we can be a part of that legacy that he's building in Japan, we would love to be a part of that future. We hope that this capsule collection where everything from the cotton being grown in Japan to the weaving of the fabric to the production of the fabric to the dyeing of the fabric really is a symbol of friendship that we have with um, Ken and the entire Freaks team and just an ongoing um, message of hope and, and support of Japan.